This year at Latham High Tech Seeds, we've been receiving a, a large number of phone calls, questions, inquiries about sudden death syndrome, a disease that's very prevalent this year in soybean fields. Sudden death syndrome is a disease that actually occurs uh, very early in the stages of growth development of soybean plants. It, uh, it attacks the, the young seedling, uh, and, uh, but actually doesn't show up in, until later on after flowering or, or even into pod fill. Some of the symptoms uh, that you initially see with sudden death are some of the yellowing, blotches like things that, that show up in the in the in the leaves the veins of the leaf actually stay very green and but there's the the yellowing and then the dark brown turns up uh, in between the veins of the leaf and that's the early stages that you'll see there later on when it starts affecting the whole plant this is more what you'll see you know where you have the dark brown between the veins, the veins are still very green, uh, and, and that's a that's a, a very uh, common symptom of, of sudden death syndrome. Now, it's also a symptom of a couple other diseases, and so it's good not to confuse any of those. Uh, brown stem rot looks a lot like this, as well as stem canker. Now, stem canker is normally a disease that we see in the southern part of the United States, uh, Missouri, Kentucky, Tennessee. It really usually doesn't affect the upper Midwest. Brown stem rot, on the other hand, can affect the upper Midwest. And so it's very important that we learn how to tell the difference, especially between brown stem rot and sudden death syndrome. SDS will have these leaf symptoms. Brown stem rot will have them also. So the best way to tell the difference is to take a soybean plant and split the stem. Now, I've taken a knife already and, and split the stem of this plant. And what we're looking for, if it was brown stem rot, here in the, the pith part of the soybean stem, you would see brown spots segmented, especially right at the nodes of the leaves. Well this is, you can see the, the plant tissue in the stem is very healthy, it's still green, uh, very viable, and so that's a good indication that this is probably sudden death syndrome. Uh, another way to tell later on in the development of the, of the disease is once the plant gets beyond this stage and really the whole plant is affected by sudden death syndrome, then the, the leaflets will actually drop off the plant and, and what you're left is a, is a soybean plant with stems and, and just the petioles sticking out and it's a very unusual looking appearance and, and that also is a, a pretty good indication that you've got sudden death. And then finally when the whole plant is affected and turned brown and all the leaves have dropped off you can go out into the field and uh, you can just actually take a hold of the plant and very easily pull it up off of the ground because the root system is so degraded and, and uh, destroyed that the plant just really has nothing left to hold it into the soil. Uh, and so that's the kind of the final stages of sudden death syndrome. Uh, and very, uh, very difficult to determine sometimes what, what it actually is, uh, but those are just some ideas. If you really, really want to know uh, probably maybe the best option would be to uh, call a professional, uh, perhaps somebody from the extension service. If you wish to, you can call Latham High Tech Seeds and we'd be happy to come out and uh, try to identify the, the disease that's actually in your field.